Most of the schedules we've looked at so far have reinforced responding at a relatively high rate. But sometimes it's not always the best to respond at such a high rate. For example, if I always did my homework as fast as possible, I might not do as well. Sometimes responding at a slow rate is the best. For example, I might reinforce someone for working on their homework and completing it slowly. Such schedules are called a differential reinforcement of a low rate or DRL schedule. They're different from fixed interval schedules in that responding during the interval actually delays the reinforcer. In the following clip, Tess the dog will show that she's learned how to respond on a differential reinforcement of a low rate schedule, a DRS schedule. Using her favorite reinforcer, rice crackers, she will show that she can sit patiently and wait for a cracker reinforcer. She'll wait about 10 seconds, and if she stands up before the 10 seconds have elapsed, then the cracker will be, will be withdrawn, and she'll have to wait the 10 seconds over again. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, five 1,000, six 1,000, seven 1,000. Wait, wait, one 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, five 1,000, six 1,000, seven 1,000, eight 1,000, nine 1,000, 10. Good girl. Wait. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, five 1,000, six 1,000, seven 1,000, eight 1,000. 9, 1,010. Eat it. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eat it. Good girl. Good girl. Do one more, okay? Wait. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, five 1,000, six 1,000, seven 1,000, eight 1,000, nine 1,000, ten. Get. Good girl. Good girl. Two 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000, four 1,000, five 1,000, six 1,000, seven 1,000, eight 1,000, nine You can see that this could be used as a way to pace yourself or learn how to slow down. If they respond too early or too fast and don't wait the 10 seconds, then the reinforcer is withdrawn and they have to wait 10 seconds all over again. <laughs>